International Air Cadet Exchange is about uh, 24 member nations that have young people aged between 17 and 21 years of age. The, the whole goal is to foster aviation um, and, and goodwill amongst those 24 nations. And the way we do that is every 12 months we conduct a 14 day tour uh, as part of the program with those host countries. We're from Canada. I'm Warrant Officer First Class David Alvis and this is... Warrant Officer First Class Jillian Wallace. Awesome. So we've... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we're going to tell you a little bit about the Canada program in Canada. You guys have uh, beautiful landscapes and uh, 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 beautiful woman. I think the, the best thing about this exchange program is seeing uh, 30 people arrive on day one, all from different countries, completely different cultures, uh, some not normally speaking in English, uh, and then by day 14, a completely blended team. You wouldn't know which country they are from. Uh, they're all part of one family, and uh, they go back home with an excellent experience of, of dealing with other young people, but also the opportunity of seeing this great country of ours. In uh, December and January of, of each year in Cadet One, uh, cadets can apply to be a part of the International Air Cadet Exchange Program. Uh, they have to be 17 years of age and have completed three years of service within the Australian Air Force Cadets and be endorsed by their CO and OC and then they undergo an interview uh, program. Well, what we try to do over the 14-day program here uh, in our country is to give those young people an experience of seeing our culture, uh, our history, uh, modern Australia, the opportunity of seeing aviation in our country, both civilian and military, and of course the opportunity of, of, of being with other young people for 14 days. The International Air Cadet Exchange is all about uh, youth development in an international context. Uh, many uh, countries use the exchange uh, program to uh, send their cadets overseas to other countries uh, in, in order to uh, experience the cultures and the uh, aviation uh, environment within those countries. It is all about uh, international fellowship. Most of the cadets uh, you know, will form lifetime friendships through this process with uh, people from countries that they may never get to visit. I encourage any cadets who uh, are eligible to apply for the program to uh, give it a go. Uh, there's lots of, uh, lots of applicants and not too many positions, but uh, uh, definitely if you can get on the program, it's worthwhile giving it a go. I think it's, it's a unique opportunity uh, for these young men and women to travel overseas and meet um, uh, cadets from other parts of the world that are in very similar programs that uh, have the same interests um, and then be able to share their, their ideas and their thoughts and their programs uh, as well as learn from the, those other programs to take those, those thoughts back home and try to implement them. I've got to say that the entire trip has been a, a great experience. Uh, having participated in IAC as a cadet uh, many years ago, um, I can tell you this has definitely, hands down, been the best experience um, from both trips. I, I would definitely recommend it to my cadets to put Australia down as their number one choice. <laughs>